Adam Snowflake reading for Quentin. The monologue is the song, You're Never Coming Back, Are You? It pains me to say this, but I guess it's true. You're never coming back, are you? And it hurts me to talk about the things you do. The good moments we had were far from few. And I hope you get that stupid singing robot. I hope you escape that awful town. I hope you get your future. I hope you get your lot. And I hope you never see how you made me frown. I hope things pick up for you. I hope you integrate and move on. That's true. And I hope you never see how you made me frown. It pains me to say this, but I guess it's true. You're never coming back, are you? And it hurts me to talk about the things you do. The good moments we had were far from few. You were the only one who understood what I was dealing with. You were the only one who believed me. And I guess I should have predicted this. You were the fifth friend I lost, but who's counting? You can't change or replace history. And you had your projects, your hopes, your dreams. I just wish you would have signaled this future didn't include me. And it hurts so much. You just moved on without a trace. Bleeding. You left me. Nothing more than a disgrace. And it pains me to say this, but I guess it's true. You're never coming back to me. Are you? And it hurts me to talk about the things you do. The good moments we had were far from few. Thank you, and I forgot to say this before, but I am over 18. So uh, the reason I'm drawn to Quentin as a character is because I think the archetype of bully is really interesting. It's personally one I've never really played before, and it's one I'm interested in exploring. The reason I'm drawn to this project specifically is because of its LGBT themes. I recently wrote a novel called The Impacted, which I've talked about on my YouTube channel and stuff a bunch. Uh, which is a superhero novel where the main character is an asexual, super-powered teenager who later turns out to be trans in future novels, but that's a whole other thing for another day. So, <laughs> LGBT superheroes is something I'm really interested in because I am LGBT myself. I am asexual panromantic, so I'm an asexual person who dates the way a pansexual would, and I am gender non-conforming. So, LGBT production <laughs> right up my alley. Um, some of my interests include act, um, acting, obviously, voice synthesizing software. So there's this really cool stuff called Utau, which is like a robotic tool, like a virtual instrument that you tune to make sing. It's like a robotic voice that you make sing on the computer. It, it's like a virtual instrument text-to-speech software, only instead of speaking, it sings. And it's for the computer, and it's really, really interesting, and I love it. I also really like poetry. Um, I'm really obsessed with that. I'm writing a poetry collection right now. Um, and those are some of my interests outside of acting. What made me interested in acting itself was the TV show Doctor Who. <laughs> uh, I've always admired Doctor Who, and it made me want to become an actor. So, yeah. My name is Adam Snowflake. My real name is Dionysus Frost. My legal name is Sam Cohen. And that's what made me want to audition for your project. So I hope that monologue suited this character, and I hope to hear from you soon. Bye.